everybody, and welcome to this episode of Awesome Knots. We're playing as Max Focus today, and it's not anything special. Literally. Uh, the reason why we're playing Max Focus today is because he's the closest knot that I have to leveling up. He's going to hit level 10, I think, regardless of whether we win, so that's going to be pretty sweet. Here's the deal. I tried to get the brawl up and running for at least one episode this week, and, um... Um, it didn't happen, so that stinks. But at the same time, the brawl was pretty fun. Uh, tip top brawl. Effectively, everybody had to play as Rocco. Although there's a small bug in the details, not everybody had to play as Rocco. But the idea is that everybody played as Rocco, and that the damage was amplified times three, so like one arrow insta killed people. It was hilarious, and it was a deathmatch thing for up to three. So it was definitely a good bit of variety. I really enjoyed it, and I had a fun time with that brawl. But unfortunately, by the time that this comes out, it'll come to an end, and there'll be a new brawl by the time. Uh, the next episode after this one comes out, and yada 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 yada. So, here we are. We're playing as Max, we're on Ribbit, and we are up against, um, Xenia, Rail, and Coco. Amit, I'm not totally, totally thrilled about that. On our team, we've got ourselves a deadlift and a gnaw. Gnaw here is going to be really helpful because of Drip Spit if he decides to get it. If not, I understand. I'm not a big fan of Drip Spit myself. However, we are going to have to be very careful this game because they have Coco and uh, Xenia. The two of them can kill me very quickly. And as far as our... Let's see, slow already, huh? As far as our ability to do damage and such goes, uh, it is going to rely pretty much entirely on two things. One, we're going to need regen. And two, we're going to really, 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 really want Baby Curry Mammoth. It's going to be more important than getting boots because of the fact that they're going to have, likely, knockback ball. Uh, they're gonna, they already have slow on one thing. Good, good dodging me. I, I did it. Hopefully that does something helpful. Final Prodigy is going bananas, which I love. Is Final Prodigy going to be okay? I don't know. I'm kind of downstairs to see. Okay, we're going to take a bunch of stupid damage and we'll likely die if the Xenia gets their greedy little claws on us. Okay, we have more than enough HP now, thanks to that creep. So we are going to be looking towards just making sure that we stay hang in the back and we support our two teammates, but very specifically, I think the deadlift is going to be doing gangbusters, so long as we don't get gang busted, uh, which is a very high probability thing to have happen here. Oh, God! No! We had such opportunities. I feel like a complete idiot. Like, we had one left click. We had one job. It was just left click one dude once. We would have been fine. We would have gotten a kill. That would have been an extra 70 solar in our pockets. We would be flying gravy right now. Holy shit. Instead, we are flying for our lives. Instead, I'll get a kill. What? Pardon? Par I can't type because it turned off the chat, but pardon? <laughs> we're going to head home. We're grabbing Kraken and we're grabbing Baby Curry Mammoth and we're good to go. Okay, so why the Baby Curry Mammoth this early? I know that Rift is going to be an issue, no matter what. And she's already picked up slow on her daggers. The Xenia, I mean. So this has two big problems with it. The first... That uh, if she's already got slow on her daggers, she's aiming to use that slow to get kills. And uh, if I can manage to reduce the amount of time I'm slowed, that would be sweet. So I'm going to go ahead and do that if, as much as possible. So the other thing I really want to make sure I do soon-ish is pick up regen. Because otherwise I'm not going to survive. But I can't pick up regen yet. I have... Other upgrades I simply must pick up first. Yeah, I'm going to let the Gnaw have that for now. That's, that, that makes sense. Um, namely, I'm worried the Xenia is definitely... Ah, the Xenia is downstairs. Do anything else. It's fine. Oh, Jesus. No. Oh, God. I think I saved the deadlift. Maybe. Um, that's pretty sweet as far as I'm concerned. We are actually getting life back, which is really nice here. Yeah, nice one, Coco. It's not like I saw that one coming from 60 miles away. It's, it's okay. But we're going to want regen pretty early on. More importantly than that, we definitely, absolutely need to make sure that we're getting damage. If we don't have damage, we're going to have a very, very bad time. No, you, no, chase no more. You stop chasing now. Thank you. <laughs> so we're going to want damage. All right, so what are we getting for damage? Well, we're going to get damage the same way that we got damage in the past uh, on Max with previous builds. The main thing we want to make sure we're doing most of the time with Max's damage is making sure that our left click is up and running in some way, shape, or form. 
There are two different ways to build Max's left click, I find. The first is doing a long range harassy kind of high mobility thing where you chase people around and all that stuff. But the thing is, you can kind of chase people around regardless. Just by, uh, you know, moving and clicking your attack instead of holding it, holding it down constantly. So, I find that that style of attack, where you get the flying camera, doesn't do all that much, honestly. Uh, what's more important to me, I find, is the burst. And if you can get the burst down on this character, you can do some pretty sweet things. Oh, hold on. Well, we got knocked down for forever. Uh, that's a problem. We're gonna run away now, like a wee little baby. Hopefully the boss doesn't barf on me. That would be bad. Thank you for not barfing on me, by the way. I do sincerely appreciate it. Grab this while we can. Well, I'll leave that for whoever needs it next. Take that stuff out free of charge. Look at that free solar on the ground. Perfect. Let's go upstairs. No! No! Stop chasing my dad lift! So Curse Jester's having a hard time playing, like, you know, keep away. Honestly, like, I'm just shooting in some strange reason it's literally always landing which is probably really bad yeah i'm just gonna poke around it's, it's fine um i would like the nod to go upstairs but it seems like the nod's gone downstairs so i'm gonna take this opportunity to go upstairs with my buddy deadlift i'm gonna get immediately hit by that that was dumb okay that didn't do very much honestly drop one of those it's not gonna do too much here either oh the snipe ow we have to probably head home soon if there's no HP on the ground. Yeah, there is. There is, there is, there is. That's good. Blast him, blast him, blast him, blast him. Good stuff. The enemy team is over here. That's okay. Should be dead. 100% is dead. Excellent stuff. Get away. Grab this. Is there HP here? No, there is not. Okay, so stay at a distance. Oh, there's Xenia around. She smells me. You know what? Fine. Nah, no, you take it. I'll head home. It's okay. I don't mind. I've got 400 solar. It's actually worth it. So we're going to grab these two upgrades. So the two upgrades I picked up, Galactic Police Scanner, gives me a little, uh, little extra bits of damage on my left click. It's like, think of it like a shotgun. So now I go boom, and it does uh, extra 15 damage. The other thing that it does is it... Um, the other thing that I picked up was the Addresses of the Stars. It allows me to... do double damage every couple of seconds with my left click. Effectively giving me a burst left click, which is great. Plus a huge amount of extra damage, which is amazing. Oh, the deadlift with the pickup kill. On point, sir. Gotcha. All right, so between me and Final Prodigy, we had that one, guaranteed. And we're just kind of blasting away at this point. One of my other dailies I had was do as much turret damage as possible, so hopefully, uh... <laughs> hopefully we can manage to put a severe dent in that this round, even if I don't get the full thing. I'm a little low on HP, and although I don't have the full 180 I'd like yet, I'm gonna run around, let natural regen do its thing, and then pick up the HP pack up here. I should have enough HP now to actually do some things. Okay, dealt like 300 damage. It wasn't enough on its own, but I'm doing enough to the rest of the team. Ah, oh, no! Really well played. I'm a little annoyed with myself. <laughs> we had that one. Uh, what are we going to do next? It's a great question. I'm thinking that we're going to go with the Intergalactic Police's uh, Dirty Secret. Now, this is probably, again, I've said it before when I played Max, it's probably the controversial part of the build because it does the same damage increase as the normal damage increase, but it doesn't split up the damage. The reason why I find I like it so much is because... I'm going to grab regen first. The reason why I like it so much is because it allows you to actually hit the damage more often, so it's pretty sweet. Pardon? Damn it, can't stop my bounces. The jump canceling is impossible with this character. Uh, please, thank you. That was sweet. I'm very actually pleased with how my reactions worked out there. I, that was on point. Especially after doing super badly in Cuphead today earlier and having to deal with the fact that Absolver is a garbage game when it comes to trying to reward new players with, you know, anything. Um, yeah. You know, this, this is actually a really needed game right now. Oops, missed the extra boost damage attack. I'm not going to go near that right now on my own. That does not seem like a wise decision. So instead, I'm going to go around and poke up here. Look at all this extra damage I can deal with this stuff. It takes no time at all to clear out a wave of droids. It's great. Good job, Dadlift. What's in here? Nothing? Hook! <laughs> okay, dealt some reasonable damage. Now I need to run. That's right, ball me. Ball me, Susie! You failed. Okay, managed to pick that up. That's fine. 
How am I looking in terms of my teammates? Teammates are going to be are totally 100% okay. I just need to make sure that no one gets killed. Yeah, I was going for the uh, Xenia hit there. Didn't quite work out according to plan, but we've got this bottom turret instead, so that's fine. Like, the Xenia is way too low to be able to do anything about this. So that's another huge batch of turret damage. Thanks. Okay, I'm just going to back off. I've got a lot of... lot of... lot of solar. You know, considering the amount of solar I got, why not? We're going to go for the 24% raw damage increase for now. Because I'm not having a lot of trouble landing the uh, the damage yet. And this opens up the possibilities of a few more upgrades that we could use, you know? Also, it means that if we land the burst, it lands it all in one chunk. Hmm, you know what? Maybe, maybe I need to be a little bit braver about my item choices from here on out. Woo! That hurt. That's fine. I got regen. And I got the ability to just run around the map, so... Deadlift went home. He must not have had a lot of HP, otherwise he should not have gone home. This is not the time to go home. This is the time to go big. The exact opposite of going home. Keep putting out as much turret damage as possible. This is part of a daily. Saving up the burst. There we go. No! Yeah, she's not coming out for that. That's fine. We need to play a little bit safe here with the Coco. Sure, we could sneak up beneath her. Okay, maybe we can get this Coco instead. Okay, dealt a ton of damage there instead. Honestly, this is fine so far. Just need to play it safe around this Xenia who just missed like everything. Which is great, but then I missed everything too, and that bad. Uh, get out. Unfortunately, Alistair is a king, has become deceased. Oh shit, railing. Okay. Unfortunately, unable to do what I wanted to do, which was save deadlifts, because I kept on getting zoned out by that, uh... Thanks for poking me so I can steal that back. Jesus. Like, calm down, lady. That was a lot of pain all at once. Uh, I need to head on home? Nope, I can stay here instead. Okay, and unfortunately there's a disconnect. That was not a rage quit. I can tell that the railing didn't want to rage quit there. That made no damn, that would make no damn sense. Okay, careful. I'm a little confused as to how this is still a thing here. There we go. Thank you. Okay, Deadlift is on his own. We need to do something about that. Make sure he's not on his own. Oh, my lord. Okay, not out of all the people there. You were the most there. Oh, that Xenia was super toast. Look, let's do something here. Come on, buddy. It's a bot. Now I'm having a hard time landing my shit. So now would be a great time for me to get the double lasers. It'll also increase our damage by a bunch. So I don't see why it's a bad move under any circumstance at this point. Um, oh, good. We got a bot. What a time to be alive. Yeah, unfortunately, not happening. That's okay. That's okay. We're still easily gonna win this if this keeps up. Especially because the one dude disconnected. Which is really a shame. Yeah, I don't know why I threw the bubble out that way. I, what I was thinking in my head was... Hey, she's gonna chase me. This'll slow her down. It, it didn't do that at all. <laughs> Uh, here's what we're gonna do. Uh, let's get more damage on our left click as well. So now we're getting the, like, the max damage possible on the character. That seems to be a reasonable way to deal with high damage characters, I find. The reason why I find that max damage is a great way to deal with max damage characters is because they tend to have a little amount of HP. So if you manage to get max damage going on, you're gonna usually have a better time. I feel bad. That should not be a thing. The, the, the bot in this game is the one reason why I'm feeling really rough about this game. Otherwise, it'd be on point. Like, They might even be winning at this point. If it wasn't for that disconnect. That's that's rough. You know what? 
At least I'm still doing okay. Still got like supremely terrifying sounding lasers, which is awesome. Okay, blast this stuff. All right. Well, it's a good thing that this episode's coming to an end soon because apparently food is happening soon, which is pretty sweet. Like I don't know. I'm not sure where my brain is right now. The, the disconnect has completely thrown me off. I'm not thrilled at all about anything. There's a high chance that a couple people might be dying. No, no. Okay. Well, we're just gonna do what we can here then. That was a decent amount of damage, not a lot, but it was something at least. Let's go down this way, start clearing this stuff out as well. At least this takes out huge chunks of HP every time we left click, so that's pretty good for dealing with droids. I, I, I really do think we've got a good build with this. We haven't really chosen badly at any point. But at the same time, we should be in a much rougher straight right now. Okay, blast this for everything it's worth. Oh, yes! I'll take that, thanks. Thank you. Okay. I want to win soon so that way I can go eat food. Uh, Raylan, that's cheating. Not sure if anyone ever told you, but that's cheating, Mr. Robot. That is most certainly cheating. <laughs> Look at that. Now let's help take this stuff out before we get killed on the backside because Coco showed up or something. Okay, we managed. Good stuff. Yo, look at me, I got a bot kill. What a man. Oh no, not today. Okay, we managed to get enough poison damage on them that at least one of them is gonna die, which means that the rest of the team should be able to manage. Alright, well that's a game. It happened. I feel annoyed that that one person disconnected, but... I mean, like, what can you do, I suppose? Um... That's a game, I guess. That means that Max is leveled up, which is pretty sweet. Not sure what level 10 gives. It's just awesome points. Yeah, it's just awesome points. But hey, you know what? I'm still going to take a leveled up character at this point because any awesome points is helpful when I'm working towards getting all those portraits. How do we do? I mean, we did great. 7, 2, and 8 is nothing to be sneezed at. We got lots of droid kills. We dealt 13,500 turret damage out of the 15,000 I needed for my mission. Tons of solar, tons of experience. We did a fine job. So... I'm not going to be upset about anything that just happened outside of the fact that LB Box is disconnected, which is a shame. Uh, thanks for watching. I hope you folks enjoyed yourselves. If you did, be sure to let me know. Hit the like button down below and subscribe for more videos. Yeah. See you next time.